What's going on YouTube? Jeans here. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day today. We are back playing some Pokemon Sword Shield, hopping on to that rank double ladder, and we got ourselves an amazing weakness policy Metagross team alongside with Tapu Fini, Urshfu, Rotom, Snorlax, and Tornadus. So if you guys are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. Thank you guys so much for the support. We just passed 6.5 thousand subscribers on this channel. Yo, you guys are amazing. But this team right here was sent in by my boy Shiv. Shiv, thank you so much for dropping this team. He dropped it over on my Instagram page. If you guys want to leave me teams, leave me anything else, head down into the link in the description below, jeans underscore YouTube on Instagram. DM me over there, and chances are I will see your message and try to respond to you guys as quick as possible. But rocking out on this team in the top left corner, we got our boy Urshfu over here fighting in dark type with that close combat. Sucker punch for first turn priority. Wicked blow as his signature move. Gets that guaranteed crit and protect with focus ash and unseen fist so we can actually hit through protects i love that ability so much tapu finny on the right side one of the best pokemon in series 7 definitely very very strong it has protect muddy water heal pulse and moon blast with that misty search and that wiki berry metagross is right behind my face cam another really really strong pokemon in series 7 especially if you can trigger that weakness policy this thing will roll out dealing some big damage and being able to soak up hits as well seal and psychic typing with clear body stopping tantrum ice punch meteor mash and protect for its move set on the right side we got big bulky boy Snorlax with Glutiny and that Figgy Berry right here and we can also recycle the berry and get it back when we lose it. We got Hammer Arm as well with Dark Slary and Heavy Slam because we are a high heavyweight Pokemon. Bottom left corner, another Pokemon that we have been seeing a lot in Series 7, and he's really, really strong. Electric and Fire Typing, Rotom Pizza Oven, and I love setting up with this thing. You can give it a nasty plot, set that up, you go plus two in Special Attack, and you absolutely dominate the battle. This thing has a Citrus Berry, Volt Switch, Thunderbolt, Overheat, and Nasty Plot for its moveset. Then in the final spot is a great support mod. We got Tornadus, Prankster ability, so uh, non-hitting moves get priority. And then uh, Wakan Berry, so we can actually eat up an Electric Shot with Air Slash, Heat Wave, Tailwind to give us that Speed Boost, and Taunt to Taunt Trick Room Music or any other Pokemon we want. Guys, you want to use this team for yourself? Rental code is at the bottom of the screen, but let's get after it. Let's hop on to that ranked double ladder and try to get some wins with this team. First battle coming at you guys, and this guy's got a pretty strong team. We're seeing a little bit of a mirror matchup with the Metagross, but I think we're both weakness policy as well. I, I really do think that Galarian Moltres could have the weakness policy. We know we see that sometimes, but my lead's got to be Tornadus. He's got that woman's got. I can taunt. I can go into a Tailwind, match his Tailwind. So Tornadus, a great lead for his first battle. Um, who else do I think he's going to lead? I definitely want to bring Finny, I think. I think Finny's uh, pretty strong here. Uh, I think I want to lead Urshfu. I, think, I feel like Urshfu just uh, rolls out. Does pretty good work all around. I'm going to go in with Urshfu in the front spot, bring Top of Finny in the back, and then the final Pokemon... Do I go with Metagross or do I go with Rotom Heat? I mean, Rotom Heat does work up against that Metagross and that Ferrothorn. So I think Heat's definitely going to come in here. But, dude, I really want Metagross here. I really want Metagross. Let me see this team one more time. I really want Metagross. So I swap out the Urshfu or Finny for Metagross. I mean, as much as I want it. Mm, I feel like the only thing that's going to proc its weakness policy is going to be that Rotom Heat with an Overheat. So, in that case, I don't think I need it. I really don't think I, I want it. I think we're going to thrive without it. I think we're going to thrive without it. Let's get rolling with this one. Metagross, get out of my face. You're not chilling here for his first battle. But, yo, dude, this team's looking fire. This team that we have right here is looking amazing. Very, very strong Pokemon out here. We also got the Snorlax, and Snorlax is tons of fun to play with because he's just bulky. He can recycle. He can just keep eating berries. But, yo, that dude's trainer card is fire, yo. It's got the little, it's like, cut out. Yo, that's awesome, yo. I always love seeing, like, cool trainer cards, even though mine's just bland. Hasn't changed since day one of Pokemon, which has been over a year ago now, <laughs> which is insane. But he's going to lead the Wimscott and the Rotom Heat. That's totally fine by me. I go in with my Urshfu and my uh, Tornadus. And do I match Tailwind or do I Taunt? I feel like Taunt's going to be the play. We are Prankster. We are Prankster, but who is faster? Let me see this thing's speed. But I think it will go to uh, the speed board. Mm. Ooh, is Tornadus faster? I think I just Taunt. I think I really just Taunt. Well, I could just go in through here. I think I just Taunt here. Taunt the Wimscott and then... Uh, I got into a Wicked Blow, yeah. We try to get some work done on this Rotom. Just getting that guaranteed crit, doing some big old work. And he's going to get off the Tailwind. That's totally fine by me. I don't think he takes out Tornadus. I really don't see that happening. We get a Taunt, so that thing can't really do anything later. And then I set up a Tailwind next game, or next turn. But I will have Prankster. Willow is going to pop out here. Oh my god, Urshfu, I love you. I love you, Urshfu. You're the best. You are the best. Do some damage here. Pop. Nice big old damage. Get that free crit. It's amazing. We can set up Tailwind now, and I believe Urshfu is going to be faster. And I can hit through protect, so I'm just going to wicked blow on you again, man. You think I'm playing around? Urshfu should be faster than that Rotami. Yo, dude, that's huge. <laughs> we get that burn dodge right off the rip. Huge, man. You'd love to see it. 
What is he gonna do now? He's gonna withdraw the Rotom. Kinda saw that coming. Should've, should've thought about that a little bit more and then Ferrothorn's gonna come out here. Imagine if I would've dropped a close combat on it. Bruh. That would've been real risky. That would've been real risky. That one's popping. He kinda knew. He kinda saw this coming. Wimsky has no moves left? Oh my god, that taunt is huge. I don't even have to worry about the Wimscott anymore. I'm surprised he didn't swap out the Wimscott. Wicked Blow is coming out here. I think I just dropped a close combat on that thing. I take it out. That's still some decent damage. I think I just go for a Heat Wave and another Wicked Blow. I think that just picks up the big, big points here. And it picks up big old points here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yo, I'm loving this. He's going to swap out the Wimscott. I kind of know that. I'm going to go here. I'm just going to drop a Wicked Blow on that left side. Bro, like... That's easy play. That's easy play. Wimps Kosh is going to struggle out here? Oh, baby. <laughs> Love to see it. Yo, that should be a double kill. I'm thinking. I don't know if the Heat Wave is going to take out the Wimps Scott. If not, the struggle will next turn. Take out the Wimps Scott. There's a double kill. Bang, yo. Out my face, yo. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Huge try of this match. He's got the Rotom left, which Rotom is really, really low on health. And I still have uh, all my other Pokemon. So, we can go. We, see, we can taunt whoever comes out if we really have to. And at least try to go for a burn with my... Uh, with my what's it called with my tornadus is heat wave he's gonna go into gash oh bro dude this one's over this one's over wrap it up wrap it up baby get him out of my face yo get him out of my face we're just gonna air slash on you and then i'm just going to uh a sucker punch no nah, no nah, we're just gonna wicked ball i know we outspeed that rotom so even if that rotom protects we still hit through it and we get one there battle was canceled yo it's that easy with this team let's get it that first battle was really, really quick. We're hopping into our second battle, and this dude's got a fire team. I'm loving the way it looks. He's got Graplock, Umbreon, Entei, Lissy, Hapu Bulu. I never used Hapu Bulu yet. And Alolan Sandslash. This is crazy, because this is Master Ball tier. This is Master Ball tier, and I would never expect to see any of these Pokemon really up here in Master Ball tier. But hopefully he actually beats me. That'd be amazing. But I'm definitely going to lead Tornados. I'm definitely going to lead Tornados. He has a Grassy Surge as well with that Bulu. I, like, you don't see these Pokemon often. He has a lot of uh, special attacking. Well, he can uh, snarl up or he can uh, will o throw burns on my Pokemon, which is kind of scary. Um, hmm. What are I really going through? Definitely Tornadus. That's 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 fair lead. Uh, do I lead Urshifu as well? I can throw big punches. I kind of want to lead Metagross with that clear body. I feel, like that, I feel like that's totally fine. Let's go Metagross. Let's bring Finny and Urshifu, and I think we'd be thriving with that. He has Grass and Berry. He has that Steel type. Just, oh, maybe Rotom might want to come out here. Rotom. Does Rotom want to come out here? I really don't see him bringing the Sand Slash. Maybe the Bulu. But I don't think I don't think he's gonna bring the Sand Slash. So I don't I don't, I don't really think we need Rotom Heat here. I really don't think we need it. I think we're thriving with the Pokemon that we had. All in nine gaming community Pokemon. Dude, this dude's trainer cards rocking too. I love the background. It's like the waves. You guys already know I'm a big fan of water stuff. I don't know why. Just always been a big fan of water stuff. But who, who are you leading, dog? Who are you leading? Entei and Tapu Bulu. All right, so Bulu and Entei is going to get Thrive near. This one could be seated. Could be grassy seated. And yo, Bulu looks fire, dude. He looks so good. He looks so sick, dude. Grassy Surge popping. This dude's got to be uh, popping out with the grassy seed. All right, you're going to lead both of them. Show me the seeds. I actually would rather not have the seeds. And it doesn't, okay? I'm cool with that. Could drop a Heat Wave. Could drop an Air Slash. I can do whatever I want. But I'm going to drop a Tailwind instead. I think I just Dynamax it. I get straight after it. I get straight after this Bulu. Get that defense boost. Um, I think he goes maybe for a fire. Oh, we might Dynamax, which is actually kind of scary. Hmm. We, I mean, with Tailwind, we outspeed. And I definitely see Metagross eating up a uh, fire move. Really do see it. He's going to Dynamax to Entei. That's got to be Entei, right? That's got to be Entei going into the max player. I'm really, I'm really hoping here that we can eat up a max player. Yeah, here's that Entei. I'm really hoping. I really am. I'm really thinking we can, too. But this will be a huge downfall if we don't. Like, I even said that. I even saw this time. Maybe I should have just swapped with Vinny, man. But I already made my play. But either way, Metagross is going to be able to get off a shot. He is going to be able to get off a shot. He can trigger my weakness spots. He triggers it. That's big. That's big. Like, we eat, we're fine. Because, again, we're going to have speed because the Tailwind. And then we're going to be able to get rolling after that. Which is fire. Fire. Give me that HP. 310. 310. Got this. What happens here? I'm gonna have Tailwind. Uh oh. And we are gonna get a defense boost. Nah, this thing's special attacking, right? So here comes my Steel Spike. Yeah. Oh. Get after it. Blue goes down here. Unless it's Sash. It's not Sash. Get him out of my face. We got the Grass Surge. We can just get rid of Blue easily like that. 
Definitely the flares popping here. Maybe, hopefully you thought I was swapping. And maybe you go for like something weird. <laughs> like, I don't know, but he's definitely going for the flare, right? Yeah, shot, bro. Go after Tronatus. Nope. Eat it. Love you. Love you, dude. Metagross is too good. He's too good. Like, dude, he's an absolute tank. He's eating up that max fire, no problem. Entei's gonna guard. Is Entei gonna guard this turn? I think we gotta make that. I think we still gotta go after Entei. I think we still gotta go after Entei. I think that's definitely the play because if we don't go after Entei and we keep that thing alive, he's gonna be able to roll out there. And yo, yeah, we're gonna go for an air slash over on Grab Block. That's super effective and shiny Grab Block. Looking real spiffy, dude. Looking real spiffy. So we'll definitely drop an air slash over on you, get that stab damage, and then we are definitely gonna. Wake over onto you, get the special defense boost as well. We're weak policy plus two. We're plus two here. And we do not see a guard. We do not see a guard. We're gonna get after it with you. Hopefully get a flinch or a KO. Give me the flinch. That's big damage, but that's big damage. Here comes my quake. Give me my special defense boost as well. I don't know if this is gonna KO. It's still gonna do a decent amount of damage. It's a Yeah. Did not KO, but we get that boost. Which is huge, which is huge. So we got Ante down low on that and we have speed advantage. So bro. I'm loving it. Metagross goes down here to the flare. Grabbox gonna come in with a big shot. Oh no, he goes for a steel spike. What do you think I was guarding? What are you doing? What are you doing? That is my question. I don't I don't know what you're doing. Grabbox gonna go for a top. Oh, uh, that's what you're doing. That's what you're doing. That's fine, dude. Keep Metagross alive for another turn. I'm here, I'm here to just stall out. Metagross outspeeds. He should still be able to take out that anti, even though we are minus two. A stab steel spike or uh and this we should we should be fine. We should be able to pick up the double click here, no problem. So we're gonna go for the quake. Get that special defense boost for that tornadus. Get after it. Sucker punch. We should be able to eat all day. Thank you very much. Thank you very much! Even though my defense was down, that's why I did a decent amount. Air slash comes out. Out my face, grab block. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Get him out of here, yo. We run in this match. Yo, Ente, do me a favor. Get him out of here. Get out my face, dude. I'm running this. I'm running this. I'm feeling real good with this team. Real good with this team. Comes down to a 4v1. A 4v1 situation. Get him out of here. I think we're going to see another cancel battle. Your boy's on fire. Your boy cannot be tamed. And you know why he's doing this? For the online gaming community, baby. You guys know it. You guys know it. Hey, let me get some of my water. Cool me off. Cool me off. Because I'm on fire. I'm on fire, baby. You're looking good. And Blissey's the final Pokemon? Yeah, yeah. Blissey, out of my face. Out of my face. Even though you're shiny, you're looking real good. Out of my face, boys. Out of my face. Get him gone. You know I have really, really low stats right now. So I'm just going to go after you. Just cancel the battle. Come on, sweetheart. Just cancel the battle. Just cancel the battle. The top of Trevor was a good call, but you just used it wrong. And he's not going to cancel. But we're just going to get a flinch instead. But here, here's a flinch. This thing's bulky, man. This thing's super bulky. Meteor Mash, not going to do too, too much. Can we get the drop on it? I think did a decent amount. Oh, we got the. Oh, it's not a drop. We got an attack boost, which is huge. Guy right, attack coming out here. Eat it up, Tornadus. Eat it up, baby. Light run. Come on, I want the back-to-back -back shutouts. <laughs> did we not? I don't think we. I don't think we died last game. I don't think we had any Pokemon that died. We got the attack boost right now. Tailwind's out. I still think we outspeed. I still think we go for this. Uh, this flinch. And Meteor Mash is boosted now because we're now we're only minus one. Let's go, y'all. Uh, Air slash. A little bit of damage. Meteor Mash coming out here. Yep, we saw it speed. Blissey Slowpoke. Like, what are you doing in here? Like, I don't know what, what you're trying to do here. You're going to go for an, a Shadow Ball now. We're going to eat that up. Both my Pokemon should be able to eat that up, no problem. Oh, never mind. Not Metagross. Not Metagross. Never mind. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> I, was, I forgot the typing real quick. My fault. My fault. But still. No! Our uh, perfect record's gone. And is this what that guy wants to do? Is this what the guy wants to do? He's like, yeah, let me take out one of Gene's Pokemon. Just to say, I took out one of Gene's Pokemon. <laughs> but that's it. He's getting it. Now he wants me to bring out Urshifu and just close combat on this thing. Right? I'm going to punch right inside that egg. Your little baby Blissey is dead. We punch it on that egg. Right in your stomach. You better run. I'm going to set up a Tailwind just for it. So my boy Urshifu gets, it, gets after it. Get it, Urshifu. Get it, Urshifu. There you go. Cancel the battle. Save your egg, baby. Save it.
Third and final battle coming at you guys. Looking for that perfect record for the Jeans Online Gaming Community, baby. Looking for it for you guys. This guy's got a pretty strong team with Regilecki, Hatterene, Comfy. He's got the Comfy, Glacier, and Comfy, Moltres combo. So that's a little scary. He also's got the Indeedee, Glacier, and Moltres, like I said. Uh, definitely Tornado's coming in here. You, you, like, Tornado's is just like, he's just a safe man. He's just awesome. He rolls out strong. Uh, Glacier, very, very scary. Rotom's gotta come in there just for that purpose and that purpose alone. Um, but I don't think I lead Rotom. Actually, do I lead Rotom? Just to have that out here, I can always swap. I can set up a nice spot. Yeah, I think we roll out from there. I think we, I think we lead the Rotom. Uh, Finny. Finny's always a solid call. Everybody loves good old Top and Finny. And then in the final spot, Metagross or Urshifu? Metagross or Urshifu? Urshifu can hit through Protect. Super effective towards that Glacier, which is huge. Um, but Metagross is also super effective to the Hatterene. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going, we're going with Metagross. We're going with Metagross. Megalos, too good. He's too good, man. Not to go with him. Not to go with him. Bro, he's too good. We just showed off in that Entei battle. Was that the last battle or the first one? I totally forget, dude. My mind's going crazy. Yeah, he just eats up that Entei shot. Like a max flare from that thing. Didn't even half its health. And then he's just like, yo. Give me my weakest policy. Out my face. Drop a Pokemon. Left, right, left, right. We're all dead. But we're going to roll here. We're going to get into a Moltres Coffee combo. Okay, okay. Man. I see it's all good. Um... Tailwind into, I mean, he's gonna trigger his own weakness policy. Yeah, I say we just tailwind regardless. We're gonna tailwind here. And I'm a volt switch. A volt switch out. I say yo, yeet, and just volt switch out of here. Save real time for a back end uh, Pokemon, or for a uh, for a different turn. I feel like this battle is gonna be tough for us. I feel like this one is gonna be tough for us. Dude, Coffee's so good, man. Like, who would have thought a little necklace, a little Hawaiian necklace of flowers? To be a top tier ranked Pokemon. Like, dude, it's so good. <laughs> it's such a good support mod. You can heal up like crazy. You can just do it all. Especially with Berserk for Moltres. I'm guessing it's weakness policy. So it gets a plus two, and then once it goes below that half health, it gets that Berserk ability popping. Gets that extra plus one on the special attack board, and then it just rolls out and dominates. So, I probably should have Dynamaxed my Rotom. That could have been a good call. Dynamax that, and then, uh, just drop a max lightning. That could have been play. Could have been play, but but I really feel like as we need Glacier in the back, I really do. Well, not Glacier. I really do think we need Rotom in the back end. And then Moltres might just storm us. Let's see what happens here. Here comes a Tailwind. Yo, give me that Prankster, baby. Give me that Prankster. And what is? What are you going for, Comfy? I don't even know what Comfy's going for. We're we're gonna both switch out. Did I trigger that thing's own weakness policy? Did you not? He read me like a book. He was like, he's gonna read it on his own. I'm just gonna attack. I think you're a pretty smart cookie over there. I think you're a pretty smart cookie. Um. Hmm. We got out the Finsters. Finsters isn't a bad call. I said we get out the Finny. Say we get out the Finny, yeah. Get out the top of Finny, yeah. Top of top of Finny, yeah. <laughs> That's my new song. It's called Top of Finny, yeah. Comes out December 32nd. That's when it comes out. So be ready for that, guys. <laughs> Missy Surge popping. Swirling around the battlefield. He's gonna go for a dark one. Chill on me. Eat up, Finny. Eat it up, baby. That's what you love to see. Um, I still I think we go for the Dynamax now. I think we Dynamax Finny. I think that's a I think that's a strong call. Unless if he's going after my Finny slot. Let's see what he's doing. What he's doing. What is Comfy doing? That's what it's doing, man. That is exactly what it's doing. What you mean? What you mean? Man, I guess we go for the heat wave. And I guess we go for the E-Wave and we drop this uh this over here. This thing's gonna be storming, man. Dude, Trick Room's up now and we're in Tailwind. Ooh, blah. Blah! He, this is what he's gonna be doing. Jeans, out my face. Jeans, out my face. Get your Pokemon out of here. He's gonna start rolling on me, I think. <laughs> I always forget that Comfy Lunch Trick Room. I always, always, always forget. This game, this game played it very, very well. Knew I was gonna proc Policy. And rolled out with that. I'm just draining kiss. Mwah. He's gonna try. He's gonna take out my Finny here. He is going to take out my Finny, which is terrible. Finny, yo, no, Finny. Here goes my Finny. Um, I think throw time's got to be Dynamax here. Or do I Dynamax the one, the only Metagross? Let's call here. I think Metagross might have to get it. Get it burn. That's spicy. That's spicy. That's a spicy meat the ball. Uh, I think Metagross does have to come out here. Just blow her. It's a Dynamax. 
We drop ice. That's the question. I think I just steal spray. In case of an ally switch, there's always a possibility. And that is stab. And I just drop another heat wave. Try and do some damage. I think we gotta get rid of Compi. I think we gotta get rid of Compi. Compi's just gonna heal up. Just gonna heal up the Moltres all day. But I think Compi, we tell it to go home. Tell it to get out of my face. And then we hope to get this match. <laughs> we gotta wait for that trigger to end, kind of. But at the same time, like, five turns is a lot. Especially when he used it mid battle or second turn. It's kinda tough. Kinda tough. Skid it a beat about. Or did he use it first turn? No, he used it first turn. He just uh, steamrolled us. Just did some work on us. But Metagross gotta get to the Dynamax. He's gotta get it. The bulky boy's gotta get it. He's the only one who's eating up shots here. You know it. Yep, I saw the floral healing. This is why I need Compi out the way. I need him out the way, dude. Look how much health he gets back. Like, what'd you mean? The ridiculous amount. He goes to darkness. Blah, 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 blah. I'm from meta. Why did I... What? What is my problem? What is my problem? I am so dumb. <laughs> this is what I get for taking a break of Pokemon for the holidays, man. I am so dumb. I totally forgot that Dark is super effective though. I totally forgot and I just lost that match 100% for me. Because I was remembering last game, I was like, oh, it's ghost typing. But no, ghost and dark is super effective. Like, what am I doing? That one's on me, guys. Take that one to the chin. That one's on me. It's fine, yo. We had two first strong battles. This one's over with. Actually, Rotom. Can Rotom make up for it? Can my boy Rotom do, do the dirty, man? Get it, Rotom. I need you. I'm gonna drop T bolts, man. We're gonna drop T bolts. I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up like that. No, I should have died in my I knew it. We have a drain against. Mwah. Jesus. Okay, that's because their special defense is so low. Yeah, yo, wrap it up. Let's Rotom clutch it up. Here goes Fiery Wrath. There goes. Down goes my Tornadus. Let's go. gonna take some damage here, Rotom. Barry is triggered. We need a KO here. We gotta quit. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Hate this game. Worst game on planet Earth. Worst game on the planet. <laughs> Come on, Rotom. Show him that you can crit too. Yeah. Ah, yo, that's over with. Rotom, you're running, dude. This thing's berserk, dude. This thing is bulking and beasting out. Such a good Pokemon, dude. Such a good Pokemon with Confi Combo, too. Especially because it's special attacking. You can't really like, burn it and neglect it a lot. But still. But still. Absolute monster. But I'm just going to run from this battle. Say, GG, man. Yo, we totally muffed that one up by Dynamax and Metagross. But we still got 2-1 in, in today's video, which is amazing. 2-1 in one with this team. Played pretty well with it. Except for that last battle. We will not talk about that. We will not talk about it at all. Like, dude, you guys didn't see that. It's all good. But shout out to my boy Shiv for dropping this team. Felt very, very good on the rank ladder. Especially with that Metagross and Tapu Finny. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that subscribe button. So you know when my videos go live. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.